from Fitzpatrick Gymnasium at South River High School. TV 35 Sports is proud to bring you South River High School boys basketball. Today, your Rams take on the Warriors of Franklin. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Martin Ledensky, along with the voice of South River Sports, Fred Roselli. Good evening, Artie. This should be a good game today. It's the last game before tournament time, and these two teams look at, matched up relatively even. Look at them size-wise. I had the opportunity to speak with both coaches. Coach from Franklin for the Warriors says we're ready for today. He made it very clear. We want to play a fast-paced game. That's our style. We'll mix up our defense and do whatever we have to. Well, the Rams are getting ready for tournament time. Uh, they're biting off a lot. They, yeah. They bit off at Ridge, and they got beat by a very good Ridge team. This is a very good Franklin team. Well. But it gets you ready. You know, you have to play competition. You play the best to be the best. When you're getting up there, you know, the Rams are the first public school to be in the top four in the GMC tournament in 30 years. Whoa. So that says a lot. And as I said earlier, the bad part about that is our, we were still out of high school 30 years yeah. ago. <laughs> I, when I spoke to Coach um, Brandon Walsh, when I spoke to Coach Walsh, he said to me, he says, we have to play a better transition game than we've been playing these last few games. Uh, so he, he knows what Rich, he felt Rich he had to. took South River out of their fast break. There was no transition. They, South River was taking 30, 40 seconds to get a shot off. You can't do that. Yeah, they like that fast-paced game. They like to control the tempo. Yep. It should be interesting because this is one of the few teams, and again, just looking at size-wise, yep. match up relatively Absolutely. well with South River. But right now we're going to be getting ready for our national anthem. That was our national anthem, and we're going to get ready for our introductions of players, starting off with the Franklin Warriors. Number one is Elijah Brown. Number two, Cam Brown, averaging 12.2 a game, no relation. We got number five, Darnell Marsha. Number 20, averaging 16.5, Cameron Snowden. And averaging 17 points a game with 51 threes, number 22, Jake Novelli. And here's the South River Rams squad. Number zero, Gavin Franco. Number 35. Number 45, Alex Grosby, averaging about 13 a game. His brother, number 35, Jeremy Grosby, averaging about 11 a game. Number 13, Laz Rodriguez, up there around 15 a game. And last but not least, averaging just under 17 a game, number 12, Roman Santos. All right, this should be a good, I'll call it a warm-up game for the tournament. Oh, yeah. Because if you have any bugs, you want to get them out of your yeah, system. You're going to need good shot selection tonight. You know, no, you know, if you don't think the shot is there, don't take it. Pass it off. Uh, I, I give credit. You're going to have to work under the offensive boards. Oh, yeah. Size there. But I give credit to Coach Walsh. He wanted to have yeah. that consistency with only a couple of days off, and that's why he's been picking up. A lot of people say, well, why are they picking up games? Let the kids rest. You, you get into that groove of playing three games a week, you yep. want to keep playing three games a week. Now, as I look here, and maybe it's just me, it looks like they got a small squad coming out in comparison to the size of some of these players there. Uh, one of the key players we'll keep our eye on is going to be uh, check Jake Novelli, number 22, averaging about 17 and with 50, 51 threes. You know he's going to do some serious shooting. Here we go. It's going to be underway. And right away, it's into his yep. hands. He's going to be one of the players out there looking to do some shooting. Here's one of the floor captains. They do like a fast-paced game. They want to move it around, get in here, get the shots off. 
A lot of movement, fadeaway jumper no good. And the Rams come down with it. Nice play. Got that one over to Laz, so the Rams strike first here. Rams going full court man. I'm guessing that Darnell Marsh is going to be their floor captain, but they're going to move it around. He says, we like quick moving that ball yep. around, everything we got to do. Gets it up, no good. Come back a second time, and the basket's good. That was there for number 20. That was Cameron Snowden. Now here they are, they're going to a full court press right. also. And here's our first foul of the game, number five, Danielle Marsh, his first and the team's first. Art, they must have got up there with a ladder and changed that yep. bulb. God bless I you. notice it's working. Yep. That's gonna be a travel. Yeah, even and though he tripped on it, yep. it's a travel. That's a good call. Hey, we, the my guy didn't stick his foot out. The no. guy, you know, he tripped on my, my attitude's always been as long as official call it consistent, that's good yep. with me. There they go. Franklin likes to, to spread the, there it is. He's the three-point shooter. I told you, he can hit the threes. You're going to see a bunch of them from Jake Novielli. And here they come with that. At Ten seconds. Oh, they'll easily get past the ten seconds. That's not a problem. From the outside, Rams no good, but look at that, they're boxing yep. out, and they're quick movement. Remember we were talking, fast transition. There he is your again. three-point shooter. Oh, he got lucky on that one. Oh, but they got the rebound on that basket. was up and good. That was number one, Elijah Brown. Yeah. And, and they, they got threw it. it away. And it's a quick 7-2 ball game here in yeah. the first minute and a half. They get another basket, you might see a timeout. Yeah, at least Look at this. Okay. There they go. Almost gave it back. From the outside for a three, no good, but Laz kept it in bounds and gets another one there. He's got all four points for the Rams right now. They spread the floor, Franklin. Yeah. That middle's wide open. Shot from the outside, the other side's up and good. Cam Brown with a three. And we got a 10-4 ball game. All right, 10 points up on the board in less than yep. three and a half minutes. Rams from the outside, no good, tapped around. Knocked the ball out of bounds, it's gonna stay. With the Rams. With the Rams. Frank, a physical team, too. Yeah, they want to play physical. They want to play their oh, style. Oh, nice play. Look at that. You catch them sleeping. And That's a foul. exactly what they got to do. Fouls may come into play. You already got two fouls. That foul's on number one, Elisha Brown. That's going to be his first. Caught him sleeping that time. Well, that's how you're going to get him. Yep. That one's in, in and, and out. out. Boy, they bring it down fast, and he loses the ball. Uh, unforced errors. Yep. So right now, Rams with an opportunity here. 10-6. No team fouls against the Rams, two against the Warriors. They got to move. They got to keep moving. That's what you need, those quick passes. Yep. That's, oh, they missed it. Under the boards. Santos was wide open. Over to Laz, they work it down into the corner to Santos. Brings it up, quick little jumper. Got it. And it's good. Back to a two-point ball game. There you go. It's those unforced errors that can make or break it on you. Look at that. Nice shot. Now we're knotted up. It's a brand new ball game. Ten Laz has made a nice adjustment there. Absolutely. Rams look like trying to double up on the ball a little bit. They're going to move it any way they have to. They work it around. Dishes it off from the outside. Takes the drive on it. Nice, oh, nice block. play. And Double a dribble. <laughs> and travel. Good try by Franco on that yep. one. All right, both squads. Fast ten pace, points. Boy. Three and a half yep. minutes. You know what that tells you. We ain't playing no 34. We're going to see who has here. stamina in the fourth quarter. That's for well, sure. 
I, I haven't seen much for bringing subs in and out, so a lot of what you have here, you're going to see here. There you go. South River smartly took it through the passing lane. If the Rams can play their game, this is anybody's ball game here. Look at oh. that. Another one there for Laz. And that's the first lead of the game. I take that back. Yep. That's the second lead of the game. Laz, two nothing. Eight points already. Eight to 12. Fight for it. Scramble for the ball. Still anybody's lose. game yet. It's going to be a jump on that one. Yeah. And it'll go to the Rams. Going to be a jump ball coming down. You got it, Art. Yeah. Okay, 12-10, Rams favor, Rams inbounding the ball right now. See if Franklin changes. That may, they may be picking him up at half court now. You give him that lane, he'll take it. Oh, oh my! Score it. No problems with that. That was number 35. Jeremy Grosby. Yeah, that was Jeremy Grosby. I'm sorry. Grosby. Uh, oh, away, yep. got a takeaway on that one. Oh, and he gets, puts it up in good. That one good. That was by number two, Cam Brown. Down in the corner, shot is up. And oh. good for a three. That basket up on that one, I think, was that Gavin? Yep. Yep. So everybody contributing. That one's no good. Kept in bounds. Back in the corner, that's the guy who pops the threes, but not that time. Rams bring it right back up, and he'll push it up. And that's court. what you got to do. You can't let them set. Well played game by the Rams right now. There it is. Uh, you may catch a timeout here now. Rams up by five. Start and extend it. 19 points in the first five and a half minutes. This yeah. is an impressive quarter for both coming up. Gets his get own the... rebound. And makes that one good. Basket that was by number two, Cam Brown. He's got seven. From the outside. That awesome. one didn't drop. Good try on that one by Alex Grosby. Dish it off over to the other end. Kept in bounds. Almost got the takeaway. Fed it to the inside. No, no good. good. But that's going to be a foul on Laz. His first. And the team's first. They started out. They got two quick fouls and have not fouled since. Minute 52 left. And you got a 19-16 ball game. We'll be shooting two. That's Cameron Snowden at the line. First one's good. There they come. First set of subs coming in. Looks like you got the big man in here, Kobe Taylor. You also have, was that Herrera coming in? Second one's good also. Rams work it around. I thought it was Herrera. I'm wrong. It's number 21, Isaac Lenars. I only saw the one when he was turning. Rams working for their shot. 125 on the clock. It pays to be patient at this. When you got a lead, it's not bad, but a, this is anybody's game, 1918 right now. Shot Boom. up and good. Roman Santos. Two. Just a two. I take it back, Art. That was a three. My, my error. Because they had 19. Shot there, no good. Goes out of bounds. It's going to be the Rams ball. First quarter, very good for the Rams. Excellent quarter. Minute left. I'm surprised Rams don't have more threes. They only yep. got, yeah, they only got two of them so far. Under a minute to go. That's on number that's, four. That's going to be a foul on Jahil Williams. His first. 
Team's third. Got five seconds to inbound, 10 seconds to get it over center court, mid court. Alex Grosby drives around, gives it to the big man, working it back to the inside over to Kobe again. Sends it to the outside to Roman. That sure. was no good. Tapped out, and here they come. Pushing it up. Ah, oh, beautiful play. Nice. Quick little jumper. Basket good. Alex Grosby with 20 left on the clock for a deuce. They probably got time here for one more shot. Travel. Travel violation. So the Rams get the ball with 14.4. 24 points first quarter. Not Unbelievable bad. Unbelievable, Art. Never expected that from anybody. They look the much better level. than they did against Ridge. Well, you learn by your mistakes. Now they got to stay cognizant of the clock. It's down to nine. When you're at six, somebody's want to be shooting or setting up for the shot. You're down to four. They got to get it off. So we finished the first period of play with the Rams, 24, the Warriors, 18. Seven points for Cam Brown. We got four points for Snowden, three points for Novelli, and a single deuce for Elisha Brown. And they're uh, two for two from the foul line. Rams are led by Laz Rodriguez with 10, followed by Roman Santos, seven, three for Gavin Franco. And two apiece for Jeremy and Alex Crosby. 0 for 1 from the line. Good right. first quarter. 24 points. Yep. That's, that's almost good for a half. Yep. That's impressive. They can keep that up there. That's, that's impressive, boy. 24 oh, points. Oh, they love up to there. run, and Franklin's right. letting them run. Well, Franklin, their coach was very candid. We want to play a fast paced game. When, when I talked over to Coach Wall, she says, we just got to control and have good transition which is what they're doing here. I notice a lot of alumni here, ex-teacher, coach here, Kenny Smutko's here, along with his son, Donnie Smutko, who Laz just surpassed last week. A lot of these guys will look at it and say, you know, we didn't have that three-point line. That you can come in handy yep. for an extra couple hundred points. Hutch with Kowski and all of them oh, love yeah. that. Oh, yeah. Okay, here we go, getting ready to inbound the ball. I see they got number three here, Samuel Matias in. Move the ball around, stop, quick jumper, didn't go in. Might be up over the back, let's see what the official calls it. Calling that one on number five. Number four. Number four, you're that's right, number five is his second. That is Jahil Williams. That's their fourth. So the Rebs only have one team foul. It's on Laz. Got it in here to the inside. They kick it back out. Kobe cuts through. Oh, travel, travel yeah. He wanted to let it go, but he didn't. Coming in now is going to be number 30. That's Daniel Okafor. And work the ball around. Kick it out to the outside. Ball is up for a three. No good. Rebound by the big man. And here come the Rams. They waste no time. He stepped on the line. Yep. That foul's going to be on number 20. That'll be Cameron Snowden, and that's their fifth foul. That was a break. I thought he stepped on the line. As did I. Roman getting a break. 24-18. But the Rams just exploded times. Yep. They were down, you know, we we're talking about it, and all of a sudden out of nowhere, boom, 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 boom. Oh, nice rebound. Oh, and did they capitalize it? Yep. Nice play by Linares on that one. And Rams have now extended up to an eight-point lead with 6.50 on the clock. Both squads got some ball handlers. Yep. This is what the Rams like. You, and they took it away. Yeah. 
Nice play. Another one for Lenars. Good, good passing on that one. That was by 45, Alex Grosby. No, that's going to be on him. Yeah, that's going to be on Laz. That's his second. second one. His second and the team's second. So Rams with two fouls, Warriors with five. And Roman's going to switch now. Not a bad move. Nope. They inbound the ball. All the way cross court. Got it, feed it to the man down in the corner, up for a three, no good, tapped around, and here come the Rams Rams doing a again. great job on the, the boards. Oh, yes, beautiful play, Roman Santos, and here's the timeout we were expecting. Rams extended it to a 12-point lead, Art. They're running, they're running. running. Art was 24-18, Rams put 16 points on the board already this period. Six points. Six points, my ear. I'm looking quick saying, wait a minute, 18. Six nothing. Six nothing that they've scored it right now. Six nothing with 6.03. But they're running. Yeah, that's what they running. love. They like, he says, we got to have a better transition. And they're doing exactly what Coach uh, indicated. He's, Coach Walt said, we want to run that. We want to get good transition. We can score yeah. on that. Franklin, they've done it. Franklin hasn't figured out how to slow him down yet. Well, they both want to play that fast-paced game. And when you're playing fast-paced, yep. sometimes players just not in the right spot where you want them to be. Rams doing a good job on the defensive boards, limiting Franklin to one shot. And, and contribution by more than just the yep. two big men under the boards. Yeah, because he'll sit last for a while with the two fouls. Yep. They didn't lose this. And this is where Linares and, and Kobe come in. They just pick they them up. Pick it up. They, they easily go seven deep. Yeah. South, we're going to go after them full court. Full court like. press. Full court man. They pulled it back. They try to turn. Uh, that's just a little bit too much. Too much, yep. Stupid mistakes. Unforced error. Yep. Uh, I see substitutions coming in right away. That's Danielle Marsh, and also coming in is Cameron Snowden. The coach seen enough on that. He figured he couldn't let it go too far. Here come the Rams. That's Alex Grosby bringing it up. Coach Waltz. Up over midcourt. Falling up something. Lonera's well, underneath. Got it over to Roman. Roman sends it back. Look at this. Feeding it to the inside. Scramble for the ball. Looks like it'll stay with the Rams. Five, just, just under five and a half to go in the first half. Rams can be patient. Well, patience don't hurt you, that's for sure. The key is you got to finish it off. That's yep. the key for them. Approaching the five minute mark. Still 30 to 18. Shut down, shut off. They're not shut hitting out. the threes. And, and yeah. Travel violation. Unforced error, it happens. Yep. That was on Jeremy Graspy. Three minutes in, it's a 6-0 run here for the Rams. It's what they got to do. And they don't back off. They, they, they set up and play, and they just play their style. And when they're playing their style, it's tough on a lot of these other teams to beat them. Nice that play one that was time. up and good. That basket was by number five. That's Darnell Marche. Their first bucket of the second quarter. And still down by 10. Double-digit lead. Oh, oh nice, nice block on that, yeah. This is their fast break. They want to get that quick, fast transition. Nice. Knock away. That might be on Lenars. So let's see. Nope. That's going to be on 50. On Grosby. Yep. That's going to be 45. Alex. No. 35. 35. Jeremy Grosby. His first and the team's third. 
And as a result of that, you're sending number 22 to the line. That's going to be Jake Novick, Novielli. Okay. First one's no good. Laz coming back in. And for the Warriors, Samuel Mattia coming back in. Going out for the Warriors is Cam Brown. Kobe going out for the Rams. 4.23 on the clock. Rams with a double-digit lead. Next one's good. Rams work that ball around. Lost it. And almost lost it back. Shot up no good, Laz with the rebound. And they'll push it up court. Nice. Reverse layup. Basket good by Lenars. Rams put it right back up to double digits. Cuts right in, shot up, didn't drop. Another one for Laz. Ah, not yeah. enough on that one. It got tipped as he threw it, threw it away. Look at the Rams just swarming on everybody. Yeah, that's going to be that's, on. That one might be 45, right. Alex Grosby. Yeah, it'll be we'll his first. What, what the official says. Yep. It's going to be his first and a team's fourth. fourth. So they could still play aggressive for one more foul. So Gavin Franco in for Lenars now. Lenars with six points this quarter. Five seconds to inbound the ball. Feed it outside and look around. They'll regroup here with three and a half left to go in a half. From the outside for a three. And he drains it. Basket good for number three, Samuel Matea. And Rams threw that one away. Yep. Eight point lead, 315 to play, 32-24. The pace slowed down for both of these squads. And another foul. That's going to be on Grosby. I just got to see which one. That's going to be on uh, Alex, I think. Uh, yep. Yeah, 45. That's Alex Grosby. That's his, his second. And the team's fifth. More important part is it's his second. That, that's where he's yeah. got to be careful. Snowden at the line. First one's good. Lead down to seven. Makes them both. This is the closest they've been in a while since they had the lead earlier. Rams took the lead and just haven't stopped, and now they're closing it in. Fed this one into Santos, kicks it back out. Work it around, 2.40 left on the clock, first half. Tried That's to a go tough underneath. one to do. Yep. Here come the Warriors once again from the outside. No good for the three, but they get the rebound. From the other side and drains the three, Samuel Matea. And here's a timeout called here with the score. South of a Rams, 32. And a Franklin Warriors 29 with 2.22 left. They came back and closed it up there quickly. It's 11 8 quarter for them now. Yep. And they started out real slow for the first couple of minutes. Rams had them scoreless. But when you're playing fast paced game, Art, one or two mistakes, and that could be a change of 6 to 10 points like blink of yep. the eye. Both teams have one foul to give before they go on a bonus. Yeah, Rams haven't scored a basket in the last minute or so. That's, that's what happens, though. They had yeah. a couple opportunities, ball in and out. Very quick first half. Looking quickly here, less than a half hour, we're almost 11, at halftime. 11 so. Congratulations to Coach Feaster, the girls' coach. Yeah, scored wins. up his 200th win here for the Lady Rams. Congratulations, well deserved. The girlies, girls really made a comeback from where they were originally beginning of the season to One where they are now. One senior on the team, so they look out for them next year. Yep. 
Fans are getting into this one. Yep. A lot of coaches in the stands. Oh, more than you sometimes want. They work, Rams like to work that ball around with some quick passes. Yeah, they're looking for that opening underneath. I think they like it when it's outside. Ah, oh, uh, yeah. unforced error. Here they come. Let them right back into the game. Well, there's a lot more game left here. I think you're going to see a lot of changes here before this is over. See if they're going to call it as a foul. No, nope, no, no foul. The ball. Good defense by the Rams. Warriors walking back to half court, still on man. But instead of full court, they're working at a half court pace. And the foul. It's going to be on number three, Samuel Mattia. His first. And that's the last one they had to give. That'll be the sixth team foul. So after this one, everybody goes to bonus situation. If there's a foul by Franklin. They easily inbound it, got it over here to Laz. Nice, nice block, block on that one. It was Elisha Brown. Help him, help him, get down there. From the outside, no good, tapped around Laz with the rebound. Over to Roman, puts it up and it's good for a deuce. The Rams needed that one, Art. Yep. A little bit too long of a drought there. 34-29. That's going to be a pushing foul. On, I think it's going to be on Alex Grosby. Look for a that'll, four. That'll be his third. No, nope, no, nope. nope. I think it's going to be Jeremy Grosby. That'll be his second. Yep. Works out better for the Rams. That's the last one the Rams had. So everybody's shooting foul shots now for the next 109. Here we go. They feed the ball around. Bring it back out to work the outside, work it around here. Gets the lane up. Uh, worst possible time to get a foul yeah. here if it's on last. Yeah, that'll be number three. Le but it's less than a minute to go. Yep, that's going to be on last. That's yep. his third, so look for, for the big man coming in to give him a little break here. You got Darnell going now for, for one and one. Oh, shooting two. Shooting two, they indicate. First one's good. Kobe in. Laz is out. I see Cam Brown coming in. And Samuel Matea going out for the Warriors. Everybody's shooting bonuses. Second one's also good. It's close right now, 34-31. Five for six from the line this quarter for Franklin. And they were two for two in the first quarter. Yep. So we know they can hit foul shots. They've really been stopping the... Uh, got it. Nice one here by Roman. Been stopping the Grosby's from getting their three-pointers yeah. off. They've, they've held them down. 13 for Roman. 10 for, for um, Laz. They'll get back in a good word. Two Grosby's will be bringing the numbers in. No good. Rebound by Santo. And here they come again. Down in the corner. Puts it up. Got and it. Drains a three. That's number 35, Jeremy Grosby. And that's a big one, Art. Extends it to an eight-point lead. That basket's up and good. That basket was by them by number five. And we come into the halftime with the Rams, 39. The Warriors, 33. Give you some of the stats here. Leading all the Warriors is Cam Brown with seven. We got six, put, six points for Danielle Marchi, six points for Snowden, four points for Novelli, and we got a deuce for Brown. And right now they're shooting seven for eight from the foul line. Yeah, for the Rams, they're led by Roman Santos with 13, 10 for Laz Rodriguez, Five for Jeremy Grosby, six for Isaac Linares, three for Gavin Franco, two for Alex Grosby, 0 for 1 from the line. And we'll be back right after halftime with the balance of this ball game. 
Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Getting ready for the start of the third quarter with the score your Ram 39 and the Franklin Warrior 33. Fred, fast game. Fast game, and your first three minutes here are going to tell you a lot. The Warriors attack the Rams on the scoreboard several times, get just about there, and the Rams put up four or five points. Boom. Yeah. They've been able to keep it at six. They had it up as high as, I think, 12 at With one point. It was a 15-15 quarter. Yep. Kept it even. So we're going to find out what just what adjustments either coach right. made. Uh, nobody for Franklin Williams has two. For South River, Laz has three. And J Jeremy, Jeremy has two. And Alex got two. two. So three of your five starters got two or three fouls. Right. That could come into play. It'll be interesting to see if Laz comes out. I think coach would probably tell him, look, I'm going to start you. Be careful. But if you run into a problem, i got to pull you. I think that's what he would do. I don't know for sure. Yep, it looks like yep. he's coming out, coming into the to play. Looks like the Rams, with their regular starters, going to yep. have the ball to start the third quarter. So we're going to find out relatively quick. First three minutes of a halftime will tell you a lot. Ah, look at that. They're trying to double up on him, doing whatever they have to. Put it up, and there That'll it is. Do it. Puts it up. That was Jeremy Grosby for a three. That's what the Rams needed on that one. Way to start it once you get into the, back into the third period here. Nice play on that one. Baskets up and good by um, Darnell Marshy. Danielle. Darnell Marshy. My error. Sorry. Rams move nice. on. Like oh! And that's going to be a foul. Yep. Good sportsmanship there. That foul. was on Elisha Brown. That's yep. going to be his second. Team's first here in the second half. That's good sportsmanship. Yep. I, I know normally they don't do it, but when you see that, that talks about respect between players. Not, not Nice bit there. Okay, Laz will go to the line shooting two. First one's good. Second one, rim zipper goes out. So, Warriors will come right back. They waste no time. They want to get up on the board also. It's got the opening. Shot up, no good. Rams with the rebound. And a foul on number two. That's going to be on Cam Brown, his first. But more importantly, that'll be the team's second. So the aggressiveness now. All right, I was going to say they're dropping back to midcourt, but they're not. Yep. Just a little bit too far. Yeah, and they're trying to suck their South River in. Yeah. Shouldn't be throwing half-court passes. Well, Quick passes. One thing I like is you see him move that ball around and give that bounce pass. Well, yeah. Tapped away, and the Warriors come back with it. Right now, the defense of the squads is dictating the game, and they're playing it pretty strong. That, that was Snowden with a deuce. To the outside, and you get another foul. That's going to be on number five. That'll be his second. That's Darnell Marshy, and that's going to be the team's third foul. Non-shooting, but that's three quick fouls in here, a minute and a half into the third period. Shot up and good, Laz Rodriguez. Rams have been able to find ways yep. to score regardless what defense they turn around and put against the Rams. And so far, they've come out all right on the third quarter. Oh, yeah. Long one for a three. No good up off the rim. Rams come down with it. Work the ball around. Look for that open player. Yeah. Got Ten. tapped away. Yep. Under six minutes to play. The idea was good. Nice play. Baskets up and good. Out and by Snowden again. 
They're not going to go away. No, no, no. This, this one's far from over. Far from over. Got this one over to Roman. Bring it back out. Five and a half on the clock. Rams with a six-point lead, 45-39. Long one from the outside, no good. Oh, Reason. nice rebound. Laz knew how to set up for that one. From the other side, that one's off the rim Short. again. And got it, got it rim back. Got it, yeah. Five minutes left to go, third period. Quick little jumper, Roman, no Short. good. Here they come once again. Warriors waste no time bringing it up court. And if they get a lane, they're going to take advantage. And that'll that's be good. That's going to be good. And that's going to be a foul. And that one should be on Jeremy Grosby, I think. It is. That'll be his third. Yes, it is. So he's got three along with Laz. And that's the team's first foul here. So fouls can can. Come and make a Darnell play Darnell Marsh has 10. And he's at the line trying to make it 11. Oh, rattled in and out. Get back, get back. Rams move that ball around. Four and a half to go, third period. Another turnover. You got two yep. on one. That basket's good. That basket by, and, and there was a quick out. timeout. With the score, 45-43, two-point ball game with 4.21 to go, Art. One thing Franco's doing is they're a little wiser to South River trying to go inside, and they've knocked away a couple and gotten the ball back. But Art, it's not getting the ball back. They got double digits up there already, 10 points here in the That's third six period. Six for South River. Yep, but they got theirs within just a little bit more than three and a half minutes. Both of these teams can explode on you. They both got shooters. They both can score. Their defense is very comparable. They want to play fast pace. You're going to face a tough defense. 421 left to go. 45-43. While we got a break in the action, ladies and gentlemen, a few weeks ago, we had a, we'll call it a charity fundraiser here, um, honoring Joseph Nigro and what he's done after his bout with cancer. They've set up a foundation. If there's any way you can help help battle the ugly cancer that's out there, please go right online to fightstrongfoundation.com. Again, that's fightstrongfoundation.com. Thank you. Now they're going to a full court press. Got 10 seconds to get it up. They're up over midcourt. Good movement by the Rams. This is that patience you were talking about, Art. That one didn't drop, though. Here they go, right back the other way, down by a deuce. Hey, gets the roll, and we're knotted up at 45 apiece with 345 less to play in the third period. Lost the handle on it, and it's going to be an opportunity for the Warriors, and they've not had this opportunity in a while to take a lead here. 45-45, they put 12 up already. Rams only put up six. Rams look like they're in a zone now. Yeah, it looks like they're playing, oh well, yeah, they're playing a zone. That's almost knocked away. That's beneficial if they played a zone. It helps avoid some of the fouling. From the outside, no good, but they got the rebound and they're gonna, shot up is good. That one by Elijah Brown. And that's the lead, first lead they had in a while with 3.15 left to play, third period. Goes out of bounds, but it'll stay with the Rams. Hey, Franklin's really tightened up their defense here in the yep. second half. I think the Rams like it when the pace is just a little faster than what they're doing right now. Seem like their pace slowed down just a little bit. That'll help. Laz for a deuce. Three. Three. Oh, Santos. All the better. Santos. Meyer. 
they rotated around and they drain a three from the outside. That's their three shooter, Jake Novelli. No foul. Here they come, got three on, four on two. And a foul. That basket was good by Elisha Brown. Let's see who they're gonna call that foul on. A basket's good. That foul's gonna be on Franco. That'll be his first and the team's second. And a quick substitution, Franco comes out. And I think it's Lenars that came in. Ooh, nothing on that one. Yep, Lenars is in. Here you go, full court press. They're going to play it tight. Theater. Cutting yeah. across court, yeah. gotta be careful. Three on one, alley-oop. Oh, that's a big one. Basket's good in a quick timeout. Elisha Brown with two quick uh, baskets there, yep. and they've now extended their lead to six with 2.24 to go. Taking South River out of their game again. Yep. This has been a game of momentum, switching either yep. back and forth, back and forth. So right now, with 2.24 left on the clock, Rams got a six-point deficit, 54-48. to 21 to nine. Yeah, well, that's, that's the difference. Yep. 21 points is big numbers. That you're, you're into yep. that area where the Rams were in the first period. And by putting those numbers up, you gotta remember, they got another 2.24 to go. Yep. Watch the scroll, ladies and gentlemen. Tournament time starts right after today. Um, this Thursday, which will be the ninth, Rams got a home game here. It'll be the first tournament game. We don't know against who. Yep. Five o'clock, all Winner the tournament games start at five. Edison, somebody. Yeah. Okay, first thing Rams got to do is inbound the ball, get the momentum back their way, but they got to finish it off with a right. number. It's got to finish with a basket. We gotta forget those cross court passes. Yeah. Frank oh. too quick. Not what they want, it's gonna be back court. Unforced error hard. Yep. And that's coming off a timeout. No coach likes to see that. They just got to put that behind them. They're, yeah. they're mature enough at this stage. You put that up behind them and say, all right, let's just start with another play and we'll take it from here. See what the Warriors can do. Gets that opening, dishes it to the outside. They're making, it, they're making the passes like the Rams were earlier. Tried to hit it off the Rams and didn't, and Rams pushing it up court. Put this one up, just shy of a three, but it'll stay with the Rams. They've been able to shut the, shut down the Grosbys, all right. right. That's, that's starting to show a little bit. Didn't drop. Kept in bounds, smart play. One and a quarter left to go. Oh, they got the man cutting through, but it didn't drop either that way. Look at this, this is a nice one. And finish it off with a deuce by Laz. Just over a minute to go and the Rams got it down to a four point lead. Long one for a three, no good. And the Rams got the rebound, bringing it the other way. Less than a minute to go. There it is. Ah, this is what they need. Rams right back in this game, single. Single possession ball game with 45 on the clock. 54-52 in favor of the Warriors. Fans coming to life, that's for sure. Uh -oh. Might be on Laz. And again, with 35 no, no, seconds. Roman. Uh, Roman? Okay. Laz wasn't underneath. We'll take that one. 
Yep. Sorry about that, Roman, but I'm happy it's on you and not on Laz. That's wrong. That's why I'm happy. His first, the team third. Rams with three team fouls. The Warriors with four. Makes the first one here. A pretty good free throw shooting team. Ah, very impressive. Two for two at the end of the first. Seven for eight at the end of the second. They're two for four in this quarter. Make it three for five. Got that lead back up to four with 35 on the clock. Ah, turnover. Scramble for the ball, but the Warriors kept possession. With 18 left to go, do you want to get the shot off? I would think they want to work for one. Nice play. And here it is, basket's good. That one was by Snowden. That's going to be, I think, a foul on number one. Elisha Brown will be his third. Non-shooting, certainly. More importantly, the team's fifth. So that means they got one foul to give in the entire fourth quarter. Four point five on the clock. They got to get that shot up. Got good it. follow, stood with it right before the buzzer to say the basket is good by Laz. And we got a four point ball game, 58-54 with one quarter left to go. Well, right now they got two players with 12 apiece. That's gonna be Danielle Marchi and Cameron Snowden. After that you got seven points for Novicki and you have eight points for Elisha Brown. Rams are led by Lazaro Rodriguez at 19, 16 for Roman Santos, 8 for Jeremy Grosby, 6 for Isaac Linares, 3 for Gavin Franco, and 2 for Alex Grosby. And Rams I, are shooting 2 for 3. And they put, not the Rams, the Warriors put 25 points up on the board here in that quarter. That's a big quarter for them, giving them 58. And, and the Rams put up 15. That's the difference in this game right yep. now, Art. Okay, Art, it's going to be maybe who has last possession here. Oh, Kobe's in, it looks like, for Roman. Roman. And I thought he wouldn't put him in for Laz, but the coach knows what he's doing here. Yep. Laz got a hot hand, maybe. He's happy with him under the boards. They give him the shot from the outside. Doesn't go in. Laz with the rebound. And Rams with that opportunity to bring it right back down to single possession here. 58-54. Ooh, that's a real long one. Yep. Nice pass. Got it down into the corner. Dishes off to Laz. Kobe. Oh, Kobe. 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 Yeah. Laz. No, no. it's got to see if it's good. It may say travel. What did it call us? Calling it a jump ball. It was a jump ball on that one, and okay. it was possession arrow was pointing down at the far end there. For the Rams. For the Rams. Working that ball around. This is the fourth quarter. There are no tomorrows here between these two squads. We thought it was going to be a good game, and it's been every bit of it yep. right now. Tried to go inside again. Approaching the seven minute mark. Rams got a four point deficit. Still anybody's game. No good. No good that again. That one's no good again. And Kobe comes up with this one. Kobe from the outside. Short. No good. Coach yelling out something here. I think he's switching him back to a man. Wide open, rattle but didn't go in. I see Roman getting ready to come back in. Long one for a three. Oh, oh in and out. It's going to go over there on the ground. It's going to be a foul. 
Let's see who they're going to call it on. Maybe number four. You got it. That foul is going to be Jamel Williams. That's his third. And the team's sixth. So there's no room for them. And the Rams still got only three team fouls. Rams inbound it quickly. It's only a four-point differential right. here, so there's nothing, no need to panic right now. Rams kept possession. Good heads-up play by the other players. Work the ball around. Reset. Plenty of time on the clock. Kobe up there, ah. no good. Tapped around. This one comes down with the with the Warriors. 5:45 left in this ball game. Right now we got 58-54 in favor of the Warriors. That might be on Laz. That's going to be his fourth. Even if they pull him, it's going to be for a short period only. Yep. That's his fourth and the team's fourth. Now you got five minutes. You pull him for a minute and a half and you put him back in or you say, this is it, guys. We've got to rely on you. At the line, Snowden makes the first. Extends that lead possibly to six right now at five. He's seven for seven from the line. Let's make it eight for eight, Art. Coming into this period, they were nine for 12, so they're a good foul shooting team. Ten seconds to get it up over midcourt. Oh. Yeah, a good break on that one. Yep. Roman from the outside, and he drains. That was what was needed. Back to a one-possession ball game. Nobody's backing off on this one, Art. This one's going right to the end. Lenard's yeah, comes take in, and Laz takes out for so. a minute or so. I would, I would expect him in at most. 350, four, right. four minutes. Almost. Almost, twice almost. Oh, good play on that one. Got it up there in the basket. It's good. That was by Cam Brown. Got it to the big man. And lost he lost it. it. And, and there's going to be a foul. Might be on Lenars, which won't be any... Any problem because he's got no fouls, but that'll send him 21. That's on Lenars, his first and the team's fifth. And he was shooting, so he's going to get two out of it. That's not the man you want at the yeah, line either. I agree with you. First one's good. This young man can shoot foul shots. Yep. Second one's also good. They're building a little of a lead, Art. Yep. You may get them looking to slow the clock down, slow the pace down. I don't know if they can. Well, sometimes you got it. You want to have that clock control. Remember, that clock's on your side. You're up by a good number. It makes it a little easier. Okay, Lenars. 64-59. Rams are trying to force a play here. Nice, nice play shot. by Roman. Wow, that could be played again. Uh -oh. Oh, almost. Yeah, that hurt. That one hurt big time. Got it now to a seven-point lead. From the outside for a three, and he drains it. Jeremy Grosby brings him right back into the game, 66-62. Knocked away. Kobe almost got it. And last coming back in now, 350. Yeah, uh, right we, talk, we, we talked yeah. about it, Art. It's, it's, you know there's so long and there's no tomorrow, so what, we, what do you got to gain by sending them in? 350 on the clock, still got a four point lead. From the outside, no good. And rebound. See the call. That's gonna be, oh. No, no, he corrected himself, he corrected himself. Officials are gonna talk about it, make sure which way it was going. 
Yep, he corrected. It's going to be Rams ball here. All right, 66-62. Smart play by the officials. Something yep. came up questionable. They took the time, talked it over to make sure they got it right. I think it was a well-officiated game. Yep, Very they let them play. Very consistent both ways. That's there what the Rams need. You're not going to run clock now. You're only up by one possession. I'd expect to see full court prep. There it is, full court press by the Rams. All the way cross court. Looks like they're spreading the floor. From the outside, shot up, no good. And a rebound taken by the Rams with 3.05 left to go. Got it over to Laz, back out from the outside. No good, tapped around and the Warriors come right back the other way. 2.45 on the clock. 66-64 in favor of the Warriors. Plenty of time left. Oh, this, this game's far from over, far from over. There's the unforced error for them. What I was saying, this game is far from over. I got to travel on them. Every official out there, we've got six of them indicating yep. travel. All right, 227. Still a one possession game, are anybody's game right now. And a timeout taken by Franklin, I think. Yep. Got to have possession, I think, to call timeout. Full yep. timeout by Franklin. So 2.21 left to go here. 66-64. Rams got five team fouls. The it's Warriors. It's a 10-8 quarter for the Rams. Yeah, they need a little bit more. That, right. third, that third quarter hurt them when they were outscored right. by 10. 25-15. So Rams have one foul to give. Yep, and Franklin doesn't. They already got their six fouls. As long as you don't do it when they're shooting. Very good game. Oh, great game. What we expected, fast pace for both squads. Uh, score was back and forth, back and forth. And like I said, that first quarter went, first half went, I think we said 34 minutes. Yep. You're another 29 minutes or 33 minutes into it right now. And you got 221 left. All right. See what their coach saw or wanted here, calling the timeout. It's going to be inbounded down towards the Rams' end of the court, and Rams are coming right out, full court press. Yep, full court man. Okay, see what's going to go. Franklin, pretty good ball handler. Oh, the, the, the team's matched up very well. No, no good. good. What you do have to remember, Art. Quickly up ahead. Except for the yes. Rams. Brand new ball game. Brand new ball game there. And this is a group four squad against right. us. So the Rams know they got a good game here, but their attitude is we play the best to beat the rest. No good. And the Rams come down with it. Got it over there, dished it yeah! off. Lenars once again, and the Rams take the lead with 1.35 to go. Coach Walsh getting his workout, sending in the signals what they have to do. Rams got to remember, they got one foul to give. And that's a big one there. A big, big rebound, rebound by Laz. Oh. All right, got away from him, unforced error. 111, plenty of time both ways. Got a timeout again. Oh, got another timeout here, okay. One thing that I've seen the Rams do this year, when they make a play like that, nobody gets down on them. He's like, yep. my fault, don't worry about it. And the team's, don't worry, we've still got time left on the clock. 
Got a two-point game right now, favor to Rams, 68-66. 1-11 left on the clock. Rams do have one foul a give, which yeah. can be big. Pretty good scoring game for high school. Great, great game, great yeah. game. Well, we knew if the Rams put 24 in that first period, you weren't going to, yeah. even though people say, oh, it could get 80, 90 points. Eh, yeah. It slows down. That's not a consistent. And they came back with a 25-point quarter in the third. Well-played game by both squads. Yeah. Back and forth kind of game. This is the kind of game, unless you're a Ram fan like we are, it's just the kind of game you hate to see a loser because right. they both left it all out on the court. Okay, here we go, getting ready to bring them in. Again, 68-66 in favor of the Rams with 111 left on the clock. One thing, Coach Walsh has gotten the big workout today. He was going up and down that sideline. 12 points for Isaac Lanera, six this quarter. He, he, he made this corner big for them, real big for them. Okay, here we go. We five seconds to inbound. They easily get it inbounded. I wouldn't think they're going to have even thoughts of leaving it for one. Oh, that uh, could be on Laz. He's shooting two. That's yeah, he looked at Laz's yeah. shirt. That's definitely Laz. Yeah. That's number five for him. Well, Laz leads with 19. Okay. Timeout. Well, it's not a timeout. Well, yeah. The coach has a time frame in which to insert that player when it's yeah. that. So they use it, quote, as a timeout. Unless Kobe they will come in. Both teams now at 16 fouls. So. Yeah. Everybody's shooting foul shots. And Everybody's shooting foul shots. I don't believe that was a shooting foul, so. Oh, they're saying it was. Well, he, yeah, he was going for it. So he has not been to the free throw line tonight. Well, we'll find out what he's made of. He averages 12 a game, so right now he's got, he's got it to, and he's got it to a one-point lead in favor of the Rams. Could tie it up with this shot with just under a minute to go. Yep, you got a one-minute ball game. That's all we can say right now. Oof. Lenar, oh, Lenar's once again. And they waste no time bringing it up court. Oh, oh, what a play. That was a big play on that one by number two, Cam Brown. Now, Rams got that opportunity. If they want to hold it for one shot, you know you're going to overtime or a victory. Depends if they, that's going to be. Got to help they him out. call a timeout. Yeah, he did. This, this puts you in a situation where if you hold it for one shot and you don't make it, you're going to go to overtime. Boy, Brown was fast on that. That was that was that could be play of the game. We usually see plays like that in favor of the Rams. That one he got, and he made it at the right time. I thought he was going to go out of bounds. We got 28.6 left on the clock, knotted at 70. You hold for one. Well, it's, it, 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 it's, it's, every coach has a different adage. When you're like this, you say, if you're going to hold it for one, the worst that happens is you're going into overtime. Yep. Rams uh, with four players in double digits. A lot of times you, you'll go in and make that quick score, and then you, the, I got confidence in my defense. I'm not worried about it. 21 for Roman, 19 for Laz, 11 for Alex Grosby. Lenars. 14. And Lenars came mostly He's in got that eight, third and fourth right, period. Got eight points this quarter. Okay, fans are cheering on the home squad here. Lenars really came to life. It's a, been a team team effort all the way around. Team effort all the way around for, for both squads. Nobody can play too tight. They're both in a shooting, shooting situation. Okay, Rams got it over the line. So they don't have to worry about that. Now they could work it for one if they want. 
so they know who what, whose hands they want the ball in. Clock at 10. Oh, oh nice play. Was Lenard. that Lenard's again? What? Well, there. I don't know what that call. It might have been a timeout. They're going to want to check the clock for how right. much time is left because if they inbound, it's going to be at the far end of the court. And if they're inbounding there, there's only 1-8 left on the clock right. as opposed to midcourt. Isaac Lenar is 10 points this quarter. Uh, what, what a play there was. He got the rebound. And, oh, they just upped it to five seconds. Okay. 72-70, okay. the Rams worked it. Missed the shot, but Lenar's got the rebound. Put it up so the Rams got a five second. Now, what they have to watch out for is a foul. Right. They're in shooting situation, and if they're shooting from outside, that's a three-pointer. Right. I actually saw something in the Ridge game, a four-pointer. He sure. made the three, three and, he and he got the foul fouled. shot. But I don't think you're going to see the ball go all the way up court and I mean, back they're going to run with it. They're yeah, going to run, run it up there to get a shot off, and a good shot. If it takes them a second, second and a half to get it up court, you only got three seconds to shoot it. Now, each of the players would know if they're shooting, you want to make sure you're in the act of shooting if they're going to foul. 18 points for the Rams, and only 12 for Franklin this quarter. Here we go. The Rams got to figure out how they're playing this. Is it tight or not tight? Fans are letting them know we want defense. There it is. This is going to tell you who wins this one. Five seconds. He inbounds it. Got it over. Clock at three. He's got to get the shot off. Did not go in, so the Rams win this one by a score of 72 to 70. And we'll be back in just a one or two minutes for a short wrap here. Welcome back, Fred Roselli TV 35. If you missed this game, you got to get it on a rebound. Great game. What was going? In case you don't know, Isaac Lenar's here with us. Ball goes up, you're looking at it, you're right on the other side of the basket, you get it, put that rebound right back up there. You was, <laughs> yeah. That wasn't the game call, but I mean, it was the game play. Yeah, um, I just saw him going down, I was waiting for the pass, and I was ready to lay it up, he gave it to me. I saw him go up with confidence, but once I saw it go, once I saw he put a little too much pressure, I knew exactly where it was gonna go, and I just tried my best to get it back into the hoop. Double digit game for you, great fourth period. You put came up big time. When Laz, we've talked about it, how when one player goes out, everybody just, picks it up a notch. Your game just went up like five notches in that fourth period. Uh, when Laz went out, I just knew that he's such a big part of the game, and I knew I had a big space to, uh, to fill in, so I just tried my hardest, and I told him once he went out, I got you. At any point in the game, did the team start to question themselves? Your squad. No, we didn't question ourselves at all. We knew, uh, you knew, we knew what we could handle and what we, uh, we could handle, and we knew this was just another game that we could just, we come from adversity and we just experienced so much that we knew what we had to do. Big game. I think they're a group four squad that you guys really, yeah. we talked about it at the beginning. We thought it was going to be a big game. We thought it was going to be a tight game. We thought it was going to be fast-paced, but I never expected it to be as good as it is. Uh, they were a tough good. They were a tough squad. Uh, they just kept, they kept hitting us back, but we just tried to punch harder and keep staying together as a team. Well, I feel like you, that's what you were a little bit tougher on this one. You came back in that fourth quarter. Uh -huh. And that was big. Yeah. Congratulations. Go enjoy your time with the other players. Let me get coach over here for Thank a minute. You. Well, coach, I'm going to let everybody know what my last words to you were today. Yeah. <laughs> my favorite ones. I want to do an interview. Yeah, man, me too. All the coaches no, know. Game, game, I tell them game. I want to do an interview because we only interview when there's a victory. What a great game. Great As a fan, game. it was a great game. Uh, up and down, back and forth. Your squad, and I don't know if it was just adrenaline or what, Laz went out. There was no, oh, it was, okay, let's pick it up a notch, guys. Um, Isaac, just right place, right time. And he indicated, I thought I'd get the pass when I didn't. I was waiting, and as soon as I saw he had a little bit too much, I was ready, and boy, was he ever. What a putback, man. Isaac played terrific. Total team effort, though, you know. Like, Laz goes out, and we're just getting, you know, who's it? Kobe, all right, put yep, the size yep, in there. Whatever you need to do. When everybody stays ready on the bench. Your number's called or it's not. You mentally stay engaged in the game is one of the things we want to do. Unofficially, we got four players double digits. Roman with 21, Laz with 19, 16 for Isaac, and 11 for Jeremy. Uh, the... The Grosby boys came out a little cold at the beginning of the game and then picked it up a notch. But defensively, they were all over that ball. Yeah, I mean, you wouldn't know with the score being 72-70, to 70, but 
I thought that we defended when we had to. It was a great basketball game, right? Well coached, great athletic team, great team in general, back and forth. I think the lead changed about five, six times in the game. Proud of our guys for finding a way to get be on top at the end. Does that mean your, your squad did good in your eyes? Oh, without a doubt. So <laughs> proud of these guys, man. I freaking love these guys. Now, you're getting ready for tournament. Two days from now, you got a tournament. That's I think right. It's the winner right. of the Edison. Middlesex. Middlesex They're playing game. right now. Game's probably coming to a close right now. Well, that don't make any difference. they got to still come home here to That's South right. River. That's right. We're happy to have home court double by. Your and your thought about the squad? Are you peaking at the right time right now? The answer is yes. That's right. it. We, we said there's a plateau. We could keep getting better. Today's a great opportunity to do so with a win like that, without a doubt. Great and, way to go into and, the tournament. And big PowerPoint time. Not that they mean anything. Yeah, but yeah, it will be. A group four. You guys really took it. And it, the game when we started, we said it could be anybody's game the way because their coach says, "I want to play real fast pace." I know that's right. <laughs> yeah, that's the sure way did. you like it. So did we. So it was a really a battle of who was going to end up maybe with the you last mirrored, session. You and mirrored. You almost hit that shot at the end there, man. I, you know. That's what it's all about. What fun, what excitement, what competition. I mean, you can't ask for anything better. I saw you on the side with that workout. I got to ask you one quick question. What does this signal mean? I can't tell you. All right, good enough on TV. I'll I'll put you off the line. All right. Take care, Coach. On behalf of myself, my good friend Art Lindensky, special (laughs) thanks to to Rich Dudas and the gang out in the truck. On behalf of us.